Hey everybody, how's it going? Today, let's take an in-depth look at the 2012 Porsche 911 Black Edition. And this is going to be a full in-depth tour of the 911. We'll start it up, show the engine, get an exhaust clip, and go over the performance data, and show you a bunch of the features on the interior as well as exterior. And today, I'm at Hendrick BMW pre-owned in Charlotte, North Carolina. And so, without further ado, let's go ahead and start it up, let it run. The 911 Black Edition is a limited production vehicle for 2012. It comes in either two standard colors, regular black or basalt black metallic. Just take the one being the standard black exterior. Six speed manual transmission. And as in traditional Porsche fashion, you have the key to the left of the steering wheel. Beautiful. Nice and thick leather wrap steering wheel. Good and tight. Three spoke polished aluminum accenting side bolster and extensions, as well as a little bit of um, leather contrast accenting up top. Two transmission options for the 911 Black Edition include the 7-speed PDK dual clutch automatic transmission or the standard 6-speed manual. Nice and smooth shifts all the way over and up for reverse. The outside mirrors also tilt down when you put the vehicle in reverse. Leather stitch D brake. And let's go ahead and cut on the headlights, fog lights, as well as the hazards. All the windows are fully automatic. And we're going to check out the exterior, shall we? Bi Xenon projector headlamps with chrome accented headlamp washers. Body colored ones are an option. LED accident lighting and daytime running lights. Smooth front end with large lower air intakes. Beautiful high gloss paint finish. Clear turn signals. The Black Edition 911 is definitely more of a stealthier package with all monochrome accenting and improving a little bit off the base 911 with as far as standard features go. You have these optional 19 inch Turbo 2 aluminum alloy wheels, graphite finished with polished aluminum accenting on the edges, gray Porsche brake calipers as well as internally ventilated cross-drilled disc brakes. On Bridgestone high-performance tires. Sloping rear end. Modestly flared fenders. Blending into the black paint, swooping headlight lines, as well as nicely designed curvaceous mirrors.
full LED tail lamps. Quad polished exhaust tips. And to pull up the rear spoiler, just hit the button down here and it automatically rises. You also have an auxiliary brake light that flips up in the spoiler. Pop the engine cover. The 911 Black Edition is powered by Porsche's 3.8 liter flat six cylinder engine. Dual overhead cam, 24 valve, variable valve timing as well as direct injection. Puts out about 345 horsepower at 6,500 RPM and 288 foot pounds of torque at 4,400 RPM. It is rear wheel drive has a modified McPherson strut front suspension and a multi-link rear suspension with front and rear stabilizer bars. And with a 16.9 gallon fuel tank, it achieves an EPA estimated miles per gallon rating on premium and leaded gas of 18 city, 25 highway. Zero to 60 miles an hour is around 4.2 seconds. And with the manual transmission, it reaches a top speed of around 180 miles an hour. Fantastic numbers. And as far as interior build quality, it's just as you'd expect from a Porsche. Nice and tight. With the integrated soft touch material here and there. Across the tops of the doors. Lower carpeted portions. Integrated storage pocket as well as stitched leather located throughout the vehicle. Three person memory, door speakers for your Bose audio system, as well as your power folding mirror control and power windows. Your power locks are located on top of the dash. Fully powered perforated bucket seating with side airbags, as well as four way power lumbar adjustment. Provide good comfort and support signature aluminum door sill plates, your hood as well as trunk release, as well as a manual tilt telescoping steering wheel, and a full Alcantara headliner. And let's go ahead and see how she sounds. Very freely revving engine. Gotta love the signature note of that flat six. And we're gonna shut her up. Solid doors. The black edition also comes standard with a lot of the optional features available in the 911. Include the premium Bose surround sound system, sport chrono package, and so on and so forth. Full LCD touchscreen display with in-dash CD player. Dimming rear view mirror, your full power sunroof, 
One touch automatic. Your garage home link, as well as interior illumination. Various preset stations, preset memory, manual tuning. Very simple. System options. You can also access your options from this button here. SIM card input, allowing the 911 to double as a mobile Wi-Fi hotspot. Hands-free Bluetooth telephone activated up here. Seek, change your source of your radio. Disc, auxiliary, iPod integration, as well as standard satellite radio. Any others? Indie Rock Underground. Sound settings. Change your surround sound. Go from your tuner to your disc, telephone. System information. Real-time traffic updates through your satellite radio, current location, integrated trip computer, your navigation, and your map. Also your adjustable navigation settings, showing traffic, giving a bird's eye view. And those are pretty much the basic features of the navigation system in the new 911 Black Edition. Two-stage heated seats for the driver and passenger, AC, recycling, front defrost, rear defrost, temperature controls and fan speed down below. Different zones, one touch automatic. Sport mode, spring stiffers. Power control to raise and lower your rear spoiler, as well as your traction control. Also among your center console, with your leather stitch shift boot, you also have a vast array of black piano veneer trim. Providing a nice high gloss clean finish to match the theme of being a black edition your lighter and power outlet, modest center console with small amount of storage, chain storage, your auxiliary, USB and iPod integration, cruise control, your intermittent wipers, headlight controls, as well as your driver information right here, pull towards you to bring you to the main menu, info, push out, to select, service appointments, telephone, your sport chrono system, just push out to activate and automatically start the stopwatch and illuminates, setting up 0 to 60s, lap times, so on and so forth. Then press out once again to stop it. You can reset. and start once again. Audio settings, navigation, oil, tire pressure monitoring system, vehicle settings, basically all of your customizable options. And those are pretty much the basics of the driver information system. To the left you have your oil temperature, speedometer, tachometer, as well as your vehicle temperature, fuel range, and oil pressure. Alrighty. We're going to shut her down. And we're going to check out the back seat. The back seats are pretty typical 911. There's definitely not a ton of room. Except for some smaller individuals. Traditional bucket seating with the carpeted accenting running in between. You can also fold them down to increase your rear cargo space. Now we're 
gonna check out the rest of the vehicle, shall we? Go ahead and pop the boot. And you can see a little bit more of the LED accent lighting. As in all 911s, you have modified trunk space up front with a small amount of storage, but just enough to get a couple bags in. Vehicles mats, emergency release, small amount of storage. Brake fluid, windshield wiper fluid, all nice and conveniently located. Same power adjustments on the passenger seat as the drivers. Porsche's specific design, cup holders hidden away in the dash. What a nifty integrated system. In your limited edition placard, number 339 out of 1911. Good amount of space. Beautiful. Legendary vehicles, fantastic performance, as well as amazing driving characteristics. Just as you'd expect from a 911. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this in-depth tour on the 2012 Porsche 911 Black Edition. Be sure to stay tuned next time, there's a lot more where that came from. Take it easy everybody.